Hi everyone! Today I'm going to show you how I color grade videos shot in D-Log mode. These videos were shot on DJI Air 2S drone. Videos in this mode look flat, have insufficient contrast and saturation. Therefore, they cannot be used for editing just like that, they must be color graded. So let's go to the color tab. We already have one serial node, rename it to contrast. We can add contrast with this tool. And then adjust the shadows, midtones and highlights with the help of these tools under color wheels. But I prefer to use the curves tool. The upper part is responsible for the lightest tones, the middle for the mid-tones and the lower for the shadows. We create an S-shaped curve, we make our picture contrasting and we turn it to a natural look. Correct a little, like this. And let's add a few more notes. The last note we are immediately calling luminance and saturation. Let's go to this menu. We choose dark and light circles and we lower the curves on the edges. This way we will make the video clean, we will not have any extra shades in white and black. Go to the second note and open the Hue and Hue menu. Here we will edit the shades of all the colors. We raise the blue and green shades a little. And we leave the red and pink once in place. Rename the node. Let's move to the next node. We immediately call it Hue and Set. Open the adjacent menu and let's lower down the green tones. We sign the last free node wheels. With this help we will create a unique mood of the picture. We use color wheels. Each wheel is also responsible for shadows, mid-tones and highlights. And also for the general tone of the picture. We may gain warm, slightly orange, gamma lead to the lower right quarter make the middle tones turquoise, we also make lift a little warmer. Like offset, just a little bit. We try not to overdo it. Now we create another serial node between the first and second nodes. I would like to make the picture a little softer in terms of contrast. We call the new node curves. We open the first menu with curves, lower the white point and raise the black point. We raise the middle tones a little at the top and lower them a little at the bottom. This is the result we got. I leave a link for a lot under the video, with which you can achieve a similar effect, saving your time. To do this, just apply LUT to the serial node. I also leave a link for a collection of such LUTs. With their help, you can process your Tron videos in just a couple of clicks, making them cinematic, and it will look really professional. You can make small changes. To do this, create another node, reduce or most of the contrast, or change the exposure. This can be done using curves. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in new videos.